Welcome back to our Lean Revolution Saga. Chapter 2. Wastes and How to Fight Them Procedure Cleanup Test Results Practice doesn't make perfect. Practice reduces the imperfection. Toba Beta, Master of Stupidity In the previous clip, we embarked on an exercise to clean up a sample procedure from garbage. I mean, unnecessary information. If you missed that video, click the link below so we're on the same page. The objective of the exercise was to review the cover page and sections 1 through 4 to identify and eliminate waste from the procedure. My assessment of the document showed that it contained numerous wastes, including company name and logo, document number, wordy title, revision history, purpose, reference documents, and responsibilities. To summarize our accomplishments, we can report that the company name and logo are potential liabilities. Consider the company or the organization terms in your procedures with no logos. Standard operating procedure equals procedure, one word instead of three. The title is too wordy, too many processes, so I generalized it. Document number is waste. Any small systems can operate without numbers. Revision history table is duplication. This information is already in your document management records. The purpose duplicated the title, so I removed the section. The scope was too wordy, so I leaned it up. Reference document section. Eliminated. References are in the text of the procedure. Responsibilities section. Eliminated. Responsibilities are assigned in the procedure steps. I documented my homework on our template procedure. You can find a download link to it in the list below. The template helps you to avoid the use of much unnecessary information in a typical procedure. In one of our surveys, we learned that most respondents thought their procedures were too long and too wordy. Well, this exercise showed how we could significantly reduce word count in a procedure by eliminating info not essential to perform a task. Just working with the first four sections of the exercise procedure, we reduced the word count from 254 to just 12 words. That's close to a 95% reduction. Simply speaking, we transformed two demanding pages into three lines with no loss of purposeful content. Congratulations to all. I hope this example clearly shows that it's easier than you think to eliminate waste in procedures. This concludes our procedure cleanup, test results topic. If you prefer to get a paperback or an ebook, click the links below. They'll take you to the right places. Thank you for listening. And until next time.